So we're going to start off here and you're going to have to excuse my pronunciation because I know I'm going to butcher some of these words. We have the Clarify and Cleanse Bar by Gut Molecules. This is a soap-free cleansing bar formulated. It has clay in it. Um, what does it say? Cocoa, co cocoa powder, you see what I mean? To help maintain a clear complexion for acne prone skin. Ignore the background girl. Vitamin C powder by Gut Molecules. We have CeraVe Hydrate and Facial Cleanser. CeraVe Renewal SA Cleanser. Witch Hazel. We have Bior Charcoal Deep Pore Cleanser. We have Gut Molecules. We have the Pineapple Exfoliating Powder. It, this has enzymes in it, you guys. It's not your traditional exfoliating product where you can feel everything, which I honestly prefer. Very, very gentle on the skin. We have the Niacinamide Brightening Toner. Um, trying to read the small print here. Formulated with Niacinamide, Vitamin C, Arbutin. We have Discoloration Serum. Um, formulated to promote an even skin tone, niacinamide serum, formulated with 10% niacinamide to refine skin texture and minimize pores, super peptide serum, formulated with tripeptides to target fine lines, wrinkles, and dullness. I need like five gallons of this. Overnight exfoliating treatment, formulated with 10% of AHA and BHA to resurface and renewed, hyaluronic I think that's how you pronounce it, hyaluronic acid serum, formulated to dry moisture into the skin for deeper hydration. We have the ordinary lactic acid. We have vitamin C serum, nourishing skin care, elasticity, and firmness renewal. We have the ordinary vitamin C suspension, 30% in silicone. I know this is a lot, you guys. Then we have some moisturizer, okay? So I don't use all of these every day. I do not. That would be a lot. And one thing I want to know is that some of these products have similar ingredients. If I'm going to be using a product, for example, that has um, this one. Hyaluronic is also, I believe, in the CeraVe cleanser. Let me see. Yes, right there. So if I'm going to be using a cleanser with the acid, with this acid in it, I'm going to avoid this for the day. Okay, maybe I'll use this the next day or three days later. All right. So next up, you guys are going to see clips of me using the products. Um, and I would try to have at least two different times where I'm using the cleansing products and the face serums, okay? I'm back with a well overdue video and this is to go over my skin regimen and what I've been doing with my skin. Now, um, I'm 39, I will be turning 40 in a couple more weeks, yay! <laughs> no, honestly, I'm very blessed to be able to have made it to 40 years old. Taking care of my skin, like really being serious about my skin in my late 20s and then up in my game in my 30s. Um, I do have some problem areas where I typically, my pores get a little out of control, my nose, my T area, my forehead, and we'll zoom in some of my skin because I think that's important. Right now, I'm kind of breaking out in the front here. Um, sometimes my skin, um, my face has a textured look to it and um, I get rough knees every now and then. You have to understand that your skin is your largest organ and so it's really important that you take care of all of your skin, not just your face. So, so I'm a, I think the best way is to really get in. And this is what my skin is looking like. So overall, I feel like my skin has evened out better and I feel like I have a better control of my pores. So disclaimer, it is quite a bit. I don't use everything every day, but I ensure, make sure that I wash my face, moisturize daily, sometimes at least daily if not twice a day, okay? So we're gonna do this starting with cleansing products, um, toner, serums, moisturizers. I'm gonna go ahead and cleanse my face. Um, I cleanse my face with my hands. Sometimes with the exfoliating products, I do use this exfoliating brush that was given to me by Red by Kiss. So I'm gonna go ahead and wash my hands, make sure my hands are very, very clean. Okay, this is what you hear the water now. I'm gonna be blind for a second. <laughs> I'm gonna get on this stool, y'all. Why can't I be blessed with height? So, I wash my face for a fairly long time. Um, and I'm not aggressive when I'm cleansing my skin. I go in circles 
Yeah, so we have the Good Molecules Clarifying and Cleansing Bar. I make sure to get my neck too. With this step, I use a toner. I allow my, my face to air dry some. Um, then at night is when I exfoliate, okay? Um, I like to use my serums, and then sometimes I use the toner in between using the serums. And whenever I apply the serum, I would allow it to dry. I mean, so my, my face routine can sometimes take 10 to 15 minutes depending on what I'm doing. Look how great my skin looks just from washing it. Isn't that amazing? <laughs> Girl, this, no, this is not an infomercial. So now I'm gonna take some of my serums, like I said, jump into the back room, and you guys are gonna see how I apply the face serums, the toner, the moisturizers, everything together, okay? All right, you guys, so I'm gonna go ahead and use the Niacinamide Brightening Toner by The Good Molecules. Um, I decided not to use the Ordinary Vitamin C because sometimes this can leave a um, a cast on. Now I think it's really important that you pay attention to the instructions. Yeah, cause it just, I don't know, I just don't like the way it, it, it you know, leaves my hair. Now it's really important if you wear glasses like I do to remove your glasses, but stand, you know, don't get all in your eye girl but it helps to get closer here um, under the eyes. Okay, that's the toner. All right, so now I'm gonna go in with the, let's do the, um, do the high, hyaluronic, hyaluronic, I hope I'm pronouncing that right, the face serum. Now, you guys, you don't need a lot of this stuff. When they say one drop, you know, they mean one drop, so, Sometimes I would take this one drop and drag it all the way across. So with me, it's typically three drops. Um, being very careful not to get anything near your eyes. Also my nose, my nose has really cleared up. I used to have really bad um, white heads. All right, so now I applied that. I'm gonna allow it to dry. Okay, I'm not gonna go in with another serum now. I'm gonna wait a couple of seconds and allow my face to dry. Now I'm gonna go in with the niacinamide serum. Same thing, not touching the skin. Typically, I save this one for last because it's a thicker serum um, and I feel like this is best for last, okay? Now I allow that to dry. You'll see what it looks like close up. Now I'm going in with the lactic acid. When I first started using this stuff, my skin would burn. I probably should have went down to a 5%. So the discoloration serum, I only use in certain area where I feel like I definitely need it, but let's just be real. It definitely gets in, you know, all over. Um, but my cheekbones, there's certain marks, and right here where I've had acne um, is where I tend to use this. So, all right, so last but not least, we're going to moisturize. Now, this vitamin C powder, I use vitamin C every day. This vitamin C powder came with a little scoop, of course, I lost it and so it's this very fine powdery um looks like crack okay Vivian this very <laughs> I'm going to be adding to um, my moisturizer okay just a little bit looks like powdered sugar okay and just work this in I'll do a close up of everything with no makeup. That's another thing I think that has really um, contributed to my skin clearing up is I don't wear makeup anymore. Um, not even to do these videos for y'all. <laughs> I don't put on any makeup. I'll put on a little, a little lipstick, a little blush. So I'm gonna be sticking with these products because this is what has been working for me. I definitely see the benefit. Um, the good thing about 
the products that I'm showing you, everything is very, very affordable. These are my favorite products out of all of my uh, face products. Actually, these four, the Bior Deep Cleanser, the Good Molecules uh, Brightening Toner, the Niacinamide Serum, the Discoloration Correcting Serum, and the Ordinary Lactic Acid. I will draw back and get the, I believe it's 5%, but these are my favorite products out of everything here, okay? I've seen the most um, improvement with the toner serum, this niacinamide serum, excuse me, it's basically with all four of these products here. I just like this cleansing product itself, but overall, um, great uh, results have been with these four products, okay? Today I'm gonna be using the Bior Charcoal to cleanse my face, just a little bit goes a long way, and then we're gonna go in there and do everything else, okay? All right, y'all, so I'm going in with just a little bit of the VR deep cleansing to um, wash my face. Other things that I also do to ensure that my skin looks great is that I drink plenty of water, okay? You need to stay hydrated. I'm trying to limit my caffeine to only half a cup of coffee in the mornings, um, managing my stress, and yeah, that right there is the pineapple exfoliating um, powder by the Good Molecules. I'm going to use probably about one teaspoon of this. Uh, you don't need a lot and just a few drops of water to help exfoliate my face. All right. <music> We're gonna go in with some toner, okay? And today we're just gonna use the niacinamide, niacinamide serum, discoloration serum, vitamin C serum, a little bit of lactic acid, and of course my moisturizer. Now we're going in with the niacinamide serum. Let's let that work in some, okay? Root Astract to brighten and improve appearance of enlarged pores. <laughs> I'm a breakout right now. A full on blackheads everywhere. So now this is a super peptide serum. Honestly, I should have saved this one for last, only because it's thicker, and I just feel like with the thicker ones, yeah. All right, going to let this one dry, and then we're gonna go in with the vitamin C, which I purchased through Amazon. This is anti-aging, nourishing skincare, elasticity, and firmness, and wellness. Um, you're good, baby? Yeah. Amen. The lactic acid by The Ordinary, a high strength lactic acid, superficial peeling formulation. Gotta be careful with this. I do like two drops all over. Um, I'm gonna go in with the, all right, going in with the lactic acid. Um, and I don't wanna do a lot today, you guys. Um, like on my nose, T area on the side, the chin I've been having issues with. So let me, I mean, I can see the texture. I know y'all like, what texture? I can see it. <laughs> okay, let me calm down. Excuse me, y'all. I, I go from one to, to 80 like that. Leos. All right, y'all, let that absorb in the skin. And then we're gonna finish off with my vitamin C and my moisturizer. I love applying my moisturizer, y'all. So forehead, I take my glasses off for this one because I try to get as close to the under eye as I can. I do have under eye, um, uh, I don't know what you call it, from the good molecules. They're patches, and I have other stuff in there under from, under my eye, but I don't know what's wrong with me. I figure since I wear glasses, you really can't see. It kind of masks my under eye, but I will probably focus on those, on that area here, um, probably later on this year, focusing on my under eye more, because I do have darkness. All right, y'all, now going in with the moisturizer that I showed earlier in the video, just a little bit pay attention to my <sighs> I 
I think it looks better and brighter today earlier in the vlog which was just four days ago honestly was it a four yeah about four or five days ago I was starting to break out um yeah it definitely looks better today you can see a close-up of what my skin looks like got some texture going on there but it's okay that's you know my it was breaking out you see that right there yeah it's clearing up now so that is it you guys this is what I do every day again I don't do all the steps every day but every day I make sure my face is cleansed I make sure weekly that I'm exfoliating I'm toning daily and I use at least two to three serums um every day and yeah that's it you guys thank you so much for watching take care